Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So the tool that we are going to look at today is the Whisper Flow. A lot of you might have heard about uh, prompt engineering, right? Uh, in prompt engineering, you basically, you know, asking computers, asking chat GPT or any kind of AI tool, what do you want? Because you get your answers by using text. You ask the computer what you want, right? What do you want it to do, correct? So to ease this task, uh, basically, I recently uh, came across this tool called Whisper Flow, which can ease this task of prompting, right? So basically, in any any tool that you see, or majority of the tools right now offer us you know, uh, where you can type and ask what you want, right? So what if if we can just say computer what we want it to do, right? instead of typing it, what if we can just say what you want? That sounds great, right? So it, it will not only save the time and the speciality of this tool is it corrects your sentences, whatever you're trying to say, it corrects the sentences using AI and rephrases it, but doesn't change the meaning though, right? So it will not change the meaning. It will keep the meaning as it is, but help you, uh, you know, rephrase it in a better grammar, you can say, so, uh, you know, frame the sentences much better so that computer can understand what you want exactly, right? Um, so I just found this tool recently and let me uh, walk through it um, so that you can understand how it really works, right? Um, yeah, so this is the website. I'm going to give all the website links uh, in the video description. This this is how the Whisper Flow website looks. So let's just scroll to the page. So it offers integration of integration with various tools. So basically, it works on uh, multiple platforms where you can just just tell what you want. Right? Uh, you can you can consider it's like text to speech, but uh, with an AI feature where it will correct the sentences so that computer can understand what you are thinking in a better way. Say is four x faster than typing. Obviously, right? When you when you talk, it's much faster than than typing, unless you are a pro typing uh, person. Yeah. Right. Let's scroll to the page. It it also supports hundred plus languages. It supports. Uh, it's it works on iOS, Mac, and Windows. Right. You can also, uh, you know, test it on their website. Also, let's 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 give it a try. So, okay. So here it comes. Let me uh, uh, give something to the system, and let's see how the tool works. I am making a YouTube video on Whisper Flow tutorial. Uh, this is uh, AI tools tutorial. I would like to publish it on my channel, YouTube channel. For my viewers, viewers to watch and learn, I would like to publish one video a day, which talks about the tools. And um, please subscribe my to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. And let's see how it goes. It's loading. Let's see what comes out. Okay. I'm making a YouTube video on Whisper Pro tutorial. This is an AI tools tutorial. I would like to publish it on my YouTube channel for my viewers to watch and learn. I would like to publish one video a day which talks about various AI tools and it, it improvised slightly. I never said, uh, you know, which talks about various AI tools, but it improvised the sentence. Please subscribe, subscribe to my channel for more videos. Let us start the tutorial. Yeah, great. So I think uh, it has done a really good job in uh, uh, Firstly, uh, you know, uh, before all this generative AI and AI tools, uh, there were tools which used to uh, hear the voice and convert to text. But the, but those are not so efficient, right? And you know, whatever output that used to come was also not so satisfactory. But if you see now, you know, almost, uh, maybe I will say 100% or more than 100%, it has converted the uh, speech to text accurately and also improvised it, right? Let's see how this, uh, how can we use this tool on various applications, right? Let me download the tool and see how it works. I'm using Windows, I'm trying it on Windows. 
I will download it. Let me install this and see. Speak to test your microphone. Okay. I see the waves moving. It's working well. Yes. Oh, with the buttons, purple, pressing OK. This is a shortcut that we should use to test it out. OK, control press Windows. Yes. Now the hardware is set up. Let's continue. Why are you excited to use? OK, Let, let's, let's do a test. I would like to use the tool for prompting, mainly the prompts that I would like to ask ChatGPT and various other tools. Oh, great, right? Uh, almost it translated everything exactly what I said. Okay, finish. Great. And as soon as you install, you see this this animation over here, right? And whenever I press Control and Windows, I see this is getting activated. I hope you can see my screen. This is getting activated. So it's basically the li it's listening. Let me try it out. Let me try it on some tool. Uh, okay, let's open chat GPT. Okay, now let's ask. Let's let's see how this works. Uh, let's let's ask uh, some question to chat GPT using this tool and see if it can convert the you know speech uh, speech to text accurately, right? And I'm pressing uh, Windows Control plus Windows. Uh, that's why that's a shortcut shortcut key I had set while installing the software. Okay, let's see. Uh, suggest me a video script for 10 minutes in which I'm going to cover A tools of 2025. You can also include offline and online tools, uh, especially in the content creation field. I would also like to know uh, the companies who created, who invented these tools, and also the any kind of funding information who are the founders? Where are they from? How much does it cost for an end user? I would like to get all the information. Uh, this is for a video script under 10 minutes. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Here's the output. Suggest me a video script for 10 minutes. I'm going to cover tools of 25. Okay. There's some mistake. You can also include. You can also include offline only tools, especially in the content field. I would like to know companies who created these tools, who invented these tools, any kind of finding information, where they are from, and how much does it cost for end user. I would like to get all the information. Great. Uh, I think it almost converted, I would like to say, 99.9% uh, accuracy, except for this 2025. Right? Maybe there's anything wrong the way I said. But yeah. Uh, but it's serving the purpose, right? Especially in this world of AI, where we need to talk to the system, we need to type and ask what we want from the system, right? And I think this tool will really help. You just need to say what you want, right? And uh, I feel when you're saying something, you can add more information than rather than typing. Uh, when you type, you generally uh, think of, you know, gra grammar, full stops. Uh, how do I? ask something but if you have to say something to someone no you really uh, work very your brain works very fast right you can say something very really fast plus you add more information when you say something than typing right because that's how our brain sub built right yeah uh okay now it started to work yeah this is my script cool you know we don't want to get into this but yeah, that's how the tool works. And let's see what other features it has. I'm opening the tool now. Uh, because I'm using a free version, there's a limitation here. Uh, there's a 14 day trial period. Okay. It is also showing what I asked today. And it's kind of uh, it's maintaining the history, what all prompts I gave. Yeah, that, that's all for today. And I hope this is useful. Uh, I hope uh, I got a something, some new tool to you. Right to try, and um, I hope this will be useful. Using this tool will definitely, I feel, will definitely be useful in, you know, prompting the tools what you want instead of typing. I think this will definitely speed up your workflow as well.
I'll cover one more tool in my next video and stay tuned. Subscribe to my channel for more videos. Uh, thank you.